Father pitied his children, so the Lord pitied them that fear him. For he knows.
Spirit's God to endless years the same.
Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Thank you so much. You may be seated. We are going to speak the hymn at page 13 as I call on Children's Choir, St. John's Methodist Church, to give their rendition. Upper limit of five minutes. No preamble. Go straight to the anthem, please.
page 14 ala de marama kari si teno kukwe kain je moya na inchine kene chere na ya godo zirai ebo bibi that is ss and s 964 Thank you very much ibo him book 145 we shall be seated as we sing Please. Let us be seated. Carry him. Sit in a book where
Should give us some space, please. Um, I want to invite actors a royal choir. They are going to perform at this time because of the nature of their rendition. I will allow their upper limit to get to nine minutes. So please, actors a royal choir. We ask you to begin your performance now, please. Much of this discussion is to be discontinued here, please. Realize that we are in the presence of God. Your discussions should be, susten should be suspended. After this service, please, you continue. Otherwise, please.
so much. On behalf of the Archbishop of Enugu, His Grace, Most Reverend Barrister C. N. Ede, I've been asked to introduce the person that is going to bring the word to us in a short while now. He is a Methodist Bishop domiciled at the Diocese of AAA. Diocese of AA is a cable of Guanyinri Diocese. Right Reverend John Chukuhota Ronwea Oji Okosisi is going to bring the word to us in a short while now. We are going to engage our hearts unto God as we sing from SS and S number 901, Ibohim book. 
191 at page 14 of the service pamphlet. We are going to sing all the stanzas of that hymn such that we get relaxed before the word of God is being dished out now. When peace like a river attended my way, when sorrows like seas below row. Upstanding, please. So gracious God, 
Indeed, it is well with our soul. But with heavy hearts, as human, we mourn the departure of our dear mother, sister, wife. It is in your hand to call anyone room whenever you wish. And so we have nothing to do than to return to your will and to ask that at this evening of service of song, speak your word to us. May your word come unto us this evening as a message of encouragement and direction as a message that will guide us to amend our ways and to prepare for our own turn. Blessed be thy holy name. Have your way, O Lord. Let me be just a microphone in your hand, but you speak the word that your servant and your people will hear. And let your word bring blessings. In the name of God the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Be seated if you have a place to sit. Let me first and foremost appreciate this God that gave us the grace to be on this side, to be part of this service. We give him the glory as we must thank him in all things and in all situations. Let me also appreciate my brother bishops that are here, my colleagues, particularly my mentor and daddy who decided this evening as a father to ask me as a son to stand in for him. I am talking of no other person than his grace, most reverend barrister, CNED. Your grace appreciates. Indeed, I want to acknowledge everyone that is here, your excellencies, distinguished brothers and sisters in the Lord. It is not my duty to begin to recognize everyone here. So I leave that to protocol. And at the appropriate time, you will be recognized and your presence will be acknowledged. Permit me to just do a justice to what I'm asked to do, and that is to present the word. It is a homily. Because it is a homily, it will be short. I know that some of us, some pe persons in this service, might be itching that the church people should run off so they can have their night. Turn to your Bible, if you have one, the book of Genesis, chapter 27. I will just read from verse 1 to 4. Genesis chapter 27. And it says, Now it came to pass, when Isaac was an old his eyes were so dim that he could not see that he called Esau his older son and said to him my son and he answered here I am then he said behold now I am old and I do not know the day of my death. None therefore. Please take your weapons, your quiver, your bow, and go out to the field and hunt again for me. And make me savory food such as I love. And bring it to me that I may eat 
and that my soul may bless you before I die. That my soul may bless you before I die. Brothers and sisters in Christ, the Holy Ghost asked me to ask us a question that becomes the topic. Before my death, what should I do? Before you are dead, what should you do? Here is a man Isaac. I wouldn't want to go to his background. I want to take for granted that some of us are aware of the person Isaac. This man, a day came in his life. He realized that indeed, Nana Lapanala, Naga Mwamu, although we're Yanya, he's so convinced, so banker, that he will die. Not a prophet told him. The Bible didn't tell us so. But he told himself, man, I'm going to die. Man, it's obvious. I'm not going to stay here to eternity. Therefore, I need to do something before I die. And let me ask and challenge us. Are we preparing to stay to eternity? Are we really sure that there are premises that we can draw to whose conclusion will be that he will not go? It can never be. That premises will be wrong because you cannot have a correct conclusion. The truth is that I na la la. And the Yanya is so convinced that he would die. He decided to do something. And what was it? To bless his son. And to bless his son, he asked for a favor from his son. I want us to concentrate on, concentrate on the topic. Before my death, what should I do? Leave the rest of the story. What the wife did and the rest of them. But the important thing that this man here said, before I die, let me bless you. Death, they say, is inevitable. Death is sure banker. I have never seen anything that is as real as death. And behold, death, a leveler. The poor dies. The rich dies. The weak dies. The strong one dies. The sinner dies. The righteous dies. Even though the difference of death of the righteous is that the death, the righteous will die here to live unto eternity. But he must die first. And so first, death is universal. I have not come across any religion in my study of comparative religion. Any religion at all. In this planet, be it in Asia, Africa, or any part of the world, that have come with a theory that their followers do not die. I have not. The common religion amongst us is a traditional religion. Christianity. Muslim. Each of these religions common amongst us believes that people die. Hebrew philosophy believes on death. 
And that is why we have common names amongst us. Omu Diegu. Omu Diwe. Omu Emerie. Omu Uburu. Omu Chekwa. Omu Dewa. And so on and so forth. In all these names, we acknowledge the reality of death. And if we do, what then do we do before we die? A story was told of a man who was doing well in his own time. But because death is inevitable, the day of his death, Mr. Death decided to visit him. This man is exposed clever. He has all knowledge, versatile in every knowledge and language. And so the man understood that this guest is Mr. Death. And he has come to him. And so he has a challenge. Having noticed that this is Mr. Death, he quickly in his self-righteousness decided to give his guests a treat of his life. To entertain him. To spoil him a bit. Maybe to impress him. Maybe to do one thing or the other. To assuage death. Probably. But he, I doubt if he can. And so he prepared me. Treated his guests, Mr. Death, so well. Mr. Death, his guest, relaxed with the kind of treatment Ima, Owe, Odiri, Obrone, Ago, Echoyiri, Owe, Odiri, Gimgas, okay. I'm not hungry, but let me test. Okay, on a mech on a mech on a mech. So he attended his guests. Unfortunately, the guest relaxed, relaxed that he left his file where he has lists of those to kill. And this wise host cleverly peeped at the file and saw his name, the next person to die that moment. He looked around and said, I wouldn't, I wouldn't let it be. Cleverly, he sneaked the fire while his guests looked the other way and canceled his name on that first list and wrote it at last. Because on one Yagabala home, I wrote it at last, the last. When the dead, the next morning, the dead, Mr. Dead, the guests want to go. He said, I must confess, you have really entertained me. But unfortunately, I must deliver. Death is inevitable. Since you have done this, well, let me leave the first and go to the last. Remember the man changed his name from the first to the last. And so Mr. Death said, let me go to the last. And he turned, behold, the name of the person, the last, is the same guest who changed it. What did he do? Because Mr. Death took him. The last thing he did with all his goodness is to trick his guests, deceive his guests in the name of entertainment with the intention of deceiving him. So what are your intentions on certain things you do in life? How good you are. What are your intentions? And uh, his normal character of tricks, of cheating, paid him that night and he died. If it is obvious that every one of us here will one day answer the call of death. 
nobody will escape death. Death comes when it will. Nothing and no circumstances stops it. If you escape it by accident, whether fatal or whatever, you may not escape it by poison or by carelessness of a daughter or your own carelessness. One thing that is certain is death will come. The Bible said, through the sin of Adam in the book of Genesis, death came. But through Jesus Christ, salvation came. And so what must you do last before you die? This evening, I want you to give your life to Jesus Christ. This evening, I want you to say, Lord, even if I'm going today, let me have a place in your kingdom. We will leave this world. Those of us, clergy, part of our duty is to conduct barriers. And we have been privileged to bury people. Also, clergymen to die. What about Jesus? Have him today. I charge you. You may be like that man. You are doing well. And you may be clever. But for adventure, don't let your cleverness lead you to hell. Let your righteousness shine before men. Jesus is the center. I want to conclude by calling everyone here. It is necessary that we give our lives to Jesus. We read in the gospel this evening. And he tells us he's the way, the truth, and the light. The bread of life. I ask you, you wouldn't lose anything to belong to Jesus. Rather, you will gain all and after here, gain eternity, which is the most important thing. That is my hope. That is the message of God. What do you do before you die? This man desired to bless his son. May I request fathers, those of us who are privileged to be biological fathers to some children, wherever they are, have you blessed them? Have you taken time to bless your children? Last night I was discussing with my mother-in-law and we had something she just said. Bishop, Problem is success with a successor. Problem is success that has a successor. Success that somebody behind you will continue on that legacy. Children that takes after you. That evening, I got part of this message. I didn't know I would be here to ask myself a question. Most of all, that have been privileged. What happens to our children? We have given them everything money can buy. One of our brothers said on teller, I have money that I can buy whatever money can buy, but he was weeping. Profusely weeping and said, I have money, I can buy whatever money can buy, but Nigeria is not good. Ah. Nana, he knows. You see, you getting me? Where are our children?
children are they blessed? When I talk about blessing, I don't talk about materials. These things are treasure, they are not blessing. The blessings of God, the righteous, is the legacy. I pray that this night, as we tune to God in reconciliation through Jesus Christ, the way, the truth, and the light, We'll also think of successor. My mentor asked me to be here because they want to have successors. Who are the people that takes over? Ecclesiastes say vanity upon vanity or vanity. Some people here, why they die early is that their successor, those coming behind them, have lavished all the empire they have built. Is a challenge. May I conclude to say this night I have a solution. The only person that can better situation is Jesus. The only one that can turn things around, make the impossible possible, as the only one is Jesus. He wore the flesh. He was born like any other human being with flesh. He faced temptations in his lifetime. And in all these things, he sinned not. Let's follow him. When we do, eternity will be granted for us. May the Lord bless us at this night. We we'll return to him. In the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Let us pray. You have heard the message. This is now the time for decision. If you are not aware, let me also remind you that Ezine Jane Gudewo Namani is dead. And we cannot see her again. The message this evening has reminded all of us that after her, who will be the next? Let me also remind all of us that are seated here this evening. Any life without Jesus is a miserable life. Because we have seen it in this world where we are. You may have the earthly things, the material things of this world, just as the message said. Whatever you think you have without Jesus, your life is a miserable life. Many, they have the money, but they do not have the joy. Many, they have the money, but they do not have the peace. Many, they have the money, but their lives and the entire family is full of crisis. Do you want peace? Jesus is the answer. Icharudo. Ezi udo, udon ke ga di gide, kweka Jesus, bata no bigi. Icharudo, ezi udo, udon ke na di gide, kweka Jesus, bata no bigi. Sing it louder. Unjogi ko ge bupu, abali oroge ye. Unjogi ko ge bupu, abali oroge ye. Unjogi ko ge bupu, abali oroge ye. Kwe ka Jesus, bata. 
No biggie. If you want to accept Jesus as your own Lord and personal Savior, place your right hand on your chest. We will pray for you. Place your right hand on your chest. We will pray for you. Gracious God, we thank you for today. From every indication, we have seen it. That it is not your will that any man will perish. But that all of us will come to the knowledge of the truth. Thank you for your love to humanity. Thank you for this great opportunity you have given to us. To hear from your throne of grace. Thank you for this day is another beautiful day. We will never forget in our lives. The message has gone out. Your children, they have heard it. The message has touched their individual lives. And to this evening is a time of personal decision. And so, Lord, I ask that the message of today will be a blessing unto all of us who have gathered here this evening. Standing on the covenant of the finished work. And in that name that is above every other name. I come against whatever may be the plan of the enemy. To take away today's message from our hearts. Lord that we never succeed in the name of Jesus. Thank you Baba God for what you have done. Cancel their names from the book of death. Let it today be entered into the book of life. That on that day, when all the saints in the four corners of the earth will gather for the great banquet, including your daughter you have called home this day, by the grace of God, all of us shall be there. Thank you for what you have done this day. Lord, it shall ever remain permanent. Your son, you have used this evening to minister the words of life. Grace and mercy, we pray more. Even as he continues to serve you, faithful in this kingdom business. Blessed be the name of God in all things. In Jesus' most wonderful name, we pray. Amen. Please, at this moment, I request ushers who are here to help us position offering plates at strategic places. We are going to receive offering in this meeting, and choir one is going to lead us as we take the offerings. You continue as long as we are still giving the offering. I hope it will go beyond five minutes. Choir one, Evergreen, please you will come up again to future as we take offerings. Please, any offering box close to you, you walk up to that place and give your offering. Thank you so much. Choir one.
May God bless you. Please, can we uh, bring together all the offering plates together? By the grace of God, we have here a retinue of ministers. And I am going to introduce my boss, who is presiding in this meeting. By the grace of God, the Methodist Addresses of Enugu comprises 11 dioceses and cuts across three states in the southeast, Enugu State, Ebony State, and Anambra State. And by the grace of God, we have a servant leader who is always on assuming, who have been saddled with the responsibility of overseeing the Addresses of Enugu is uh, an enchelon, a man that God has blessed in several ways. God had given him grace. He has the ecclesiastical aura and dexterity, a man that we respect so much. At the moment, in Methodist Church, Nigeria, he is the most senior archbishop, not in age, but in service and experience of Methodist Church, Nigeria. A workaholic. Um, he is here seated, but he has not spoken all the while. I want to introduce to this audience the man of the people with a centripetal capacity, his grace, most Reverend Barrister C.N. Ede, Archbishop of Enugu. Your Grace, with mommy, they are here. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. In the Methodist Church, we say, Worthy is the Lamb. And you also shout hallelujah. Worthy is the lamb. Worthy, worthy, worthy is the lamb. Your excellencies, as expected, we have in this service the cream de la cream of society. And I'm going to leave the protocol unit to handle that in due course. But I want to recognize the men of God who are here with us. And to also bring to you the message of the leader of our church, His Eminence. Dr. Oliver Abba. We have by my right, and I'm going to introduce just the presbyters and the bishops, the man who has been leading the conduct of this service is the Archdiocese and Council Secretary and the presbyter of the church. The very Reverend Joel Okoria, a man who also doubles as the Synod Secretary to Inugu Diocese. 
and just by him is the Bishop of Newi Diocese. The Bishop of Newi Diocese is the son of the soil of Onkano. He is the Right Reverend Emmanuel Naji. And right by my side is the Bishop of Okonano Diocese, the man who has just taken over the saddle of the new diocese of Okonano with its headquarters at Obofia. The right Reverend Dennis Okechukumak. He's also a son of this soil. And by my left is the man who just brought the homily. Like has, has been introduced, he is the Bishop of Akego Guaniri, AAA. The right Reverend John Oji. And we have the privilege of the presence of our Father in the Lord, the Bishop of the Anglican Communion, and the Archbishop of the Ecclesiastical Province of Enugu, Anglican Communion, His Grace, Most Reverend Professor E. O. Chukuma, O. O. N and the wife. My name is Archbishop Barrister Christopher Ede, and I'm here with my wife too, who is a daughter of the soil, Adan Kano. Your Excellencies, I bring to you the greetings of the leader of our church, His Eminence, Dr. Oliver Ali Aba. We had actually arranged to have the two prelates, the immediate past prelate and the sitting prelate in this service. Fortunately, His Eminence, Dr. S.C.K. Uche, the immediate uh, past prelate who just retired by December this year, a friend of this family, had an emergency outside the country and I had to leave and asked me to tell Your Excellency that he will be here immediately on arrival from overseas. His absence is inevitable. Up until last night, I worked with the protocol department organizing this ceremony if need be, to bring in the prelates, even if it be with a private aircraft. But he said, way to Yola in the north, and efforts to bring him back proved abortive. He has asked us to represent him in this service and to bring his greetings to the family the condolence of the entire Methodist family throughout Nigeria. He too, in due course by July, will be visiting this family to condole with His Excellency. And so on behalf of all the clergy here, bishops and presbyters and ministers of other ranks, we bring to this family our hearty condolences on the demise of Our Lady, Ezine Jane Ude Wonamani, a very amiable lady whose life and times is a full book that we read in this time. We will invite the family now for prayers. And I will ask that the family, the immediate family, will please come and let us pray. Take 
away the podium so that we can have them in front of us here. All the ministers will rise and we shall pray together for the family. Budo di kosi miri ne ru no zom just stand. We so bubiara kebili no no du mabo la ime wo kam si all the ma all the ri obi ma. All the ma, all the ma, all the ma, all the re, oh be ma. E kwe su ge so bu o wo wa gabia kanto. Quasi o bimaka na Christ amata oni e kadem we wo si obara yani he odima odima o odima. All the ma, all the re, oh be ma. Oya wa inezi, ogun wa gabia, nsobu gabia. Ma ni mo le ntukwa siyo binanka. Na Christ na mata wu ni kadi ya. Na yo nwe ya buranyi ike. Ni hi ae. O bulan da bere ne ezi okuwa. Kain ne guze ba na uke mbede ya. Ne che ezi no lo. Nke. O rugi nwa anye. O nyi ikporo kola ha chipitegi. Is in the gen who they want the money. When you want your booking window, or booking the yendo, or booking the chiquando, or booking a sindula hachi, aja la raja, into a laranto, ndo, ginere, a la chiquitegi. Ni yao bu hii wele ki wele. Nye mwe yi ki juga juju. Ni yi na uwe nye mwe yi hene wele hea. Ma yi zi tu kwa siobi anye mwene. Na ki bu chile ke me wo. Ka nye mwe yi zi o li lanya lo siri ke. Na si no mwa abia. O ka yi buta ae. Ni yi na zi ka no mwa. Ni kanandu, nongu, ike nyanyi udogi. Ni hiachine kaya ina ari udoa. Ni zinu lo. Nke ina nyuku. Na mwa ki ngoke. Sake nina mane. Aina ari udoa nisi ya. Nisi omo. Nisi ndi ogo. Nisi ndi ipu ni ibe ndi enyi. Ndini ile onwa mekutela. Aina yon kasi obi ke nani mwa sone nye. Ona abu mwa soki kasi anye obi. Kasi obi akini iruna madun ki ima ay. Ndon ke maduna asi. Ode ma. Manodye nye kasi obi zuro ke. Ma Jesus. Obugi bo kasi obi zuro ke. Ni ya nye zwe zino la. Na nye ni le ndi. Un hapon ke. Nye anye na wana anye mwa yeme kutere. Un kasi obi ke zuro ke na ha Jesus. 
I look at Chitak and Kelly. You went. You and your Padula and Ebo Bibi Aloma Ebo Ledo. We hear Edgy me Eba Nagije. What all you talk? Nigga Mere or Gimwan, a better Nigga, not on Kurobia. Nigga goes weak. Na patake Abraham, we will not need to go. God will turn our hearts, Jesus. When you want to know, oh, oh, your man can't do Russia. Nya nya mara, oh, your brother don't even chin eke. Can you just do a bit? Do one nya juju. Quando one nya in coma, ni no one na bia. Which you can kill you kind, the end why? Looks like a mood like a city. That's no more idea. Now you keep talking a lazy game. And you quick, very young, mad to me, Bara, me, him, and me. Looking at Cassian, you be chinaka. I know you're no gay and the mad man who can't want to. Where's the game won't call? It's it in the game now, Jesus. Join in a yen do zuroke. Ne omogin do zuroke. Nen omogin do juriju. Can you make it nanny kelly Nandua. E won. Like you would chinic with chi eye. And you wine bomoge. I need che a memeni link against suchi. Easy, mamma, I gan call my rugi. Ta nechi. Chineke wele bregi. Khazye he doom. No zoge nye gyo tuto. Oye wanyi. Igwe li igwe. Ga soporo. Oli li nko lugi wanyi. Ndi doom nga abya. Mandi ge fene lu. Mandi ga gana la. Ha ga abya nudo. Ha ga la ha chi nudo. Chineke ayi. Odigi inye ob la. Ekwe suge zite. Ni me 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 an ke gabo ihe eteta moto kamo gabo me 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 an ni le gasire an ke la ya na zo an gasi ne zie chineke dema de wo chineke ay no yere rugi wo ke no ya no yere ndi ku na ndi be gozie ma dudu ni bere bata onye wa ay were beregi ku oku ni si ay ni ni beregi ka makari ipe Jesus Christ, Amen. 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 Yes, you will have to wait. Yes. Okay. The first son. Oh yes. Women are lying and Bob la any run in ye na to a again ye is no ka hadin yaka. Away he grabu genu and all in here or hanese neba yene bakiji nyaka in yenema do or ji. God bless you. Good evening, everybody, uh, friends and family. Uh, my name is uh, Nabihe Namani, and I'm representing the entire family. Um, on behalf of the family, I want to uh, express a very warm welcome to everybody who has come to honor the life of our dear mother, uh, wife, sister, Ezine Lady Jane Namani. Uh, your presence uh, means a lot to, uh, to us today. And we're greatly honored, very grateful by the amount of support we have gotten from people far and wide. Um, as we honor to wish our mother 
uh, uh, one last goodbye. Um, I pray her values uh, will continue to guide us, as the uh, b uh, bishop said, um, we should amend our ways so that we'll be ready uh, when it's our time to go. Uh, on this note, uh, may her soul rest in peace. May God grant the entire uh, family uh, fortitude to bear this loss. And um, wherever she is, may we continue to do things that will make her happy and proud. In Jesus' name, amen. Uh, please, at this moment, I would request the protocol. I'm going to time you also. If you exceed my time, I pick my microphone at the moment. Please, the protocol is to come to give recognition to some people, the most important ones. Tomorrow we'll continue. Thank you. All of you are important. Nobody is most important here. And so, Your Excellencies, I'd like to say thank you to all of you for coming. As we continue to uphold this amazing Nigerian, democracy is over 25 years old in Nigeria because this man, after two terms, locked the, the door and threw away the key. We say thank you to you and we uphold you and your family at this event. I'd like to also welcome here the former governor of Old Anambra State, an elder statesman that we can go to war with, amazing man. At over 83, he still looks amazingly handsome. We welcome here Chief James Ifanyu Chukumodo. I won't, uh, I welcome you, sir. Chief Ukwesileze Mwodo and his lovely wife are here. I welcome you. Chief Sullivan uh, Chime, former governor of Enugu State, is also here. Uh, the immediate past governor of Enugu State, Right Honorable Ifai Gwai, is also here. I'd like to welcome a man that has done amazingly in Imo State, former governor, senator, and his touching lives. There are over one million Nigerian children that have education today because this man has raised their hopes. So the thing we said to Owele Rocha Sokorocha, we say thank you for coming here. Let me also welcome all the way from Ogun State, former governor of Ogun State, senator of the Federal Republic, the man that placed Ogun State on the map made it the gateway state. The man that placed it, that gave it drums. Uh, of course, I remember your drumming festival. Distinguished Senator Ibi Kunle Amosu, I welcome you. I'd like us here to especially appreciate one man here. And while I'm talking, um, Honorable Sanuchi Dagash walked in. Dr. Idi Hong also walked in, former Minister of Health. I'd like to specially recognize the Senate president between 2000 and 2003. This event was slated for 5 p.m. This man was seated at 4. Former Secretary of the Government of the Federation, I'd like to appreciate and welcome here the Civil Senator Aim Pius Aim. All the way from Bauchi State, Honorable Rifka to Samson Dana. Former Chief Whip, Bauchu State House of Assembly, is also here with us. We welcome you. Um, my colleagues here have other names. Um, We've done a lot. Let's round off the service. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. God bless you. Please, the choirs are going to lead us in Hallelujah Chorus. We are going to leave the other hymn for next time. Hallelujah Chorus. We shall all be upstanding. The choirs to lead us in Hallelujah Chorus. The choirs together so that we'll bring the service to a close.
the choirs together, I, I request that you should stand up, please. In fact, everybody, whenever Hallelujah Chorus is being rendered, everybody will be upstanding. Choir master, please be fast about this. Please be seated. And before we say the closing prayer, just a fast reminder that tomorrow the service starts at 10 a.m. And we will request you to arrive early enough to take your seat as we will not allow people to crisscross the altar area during that service. 10 a.m. Uh, so 11 a.m., and the venue is Ophia Auto Field. That is where the service will take place. And on Sunday, there will be the outing service at St. John's Methodist Church. You are invited to be part of those programs. Please, we will want to pray. Your grace, just a few minutes after praying before you start your convivialities. Let us all pray. Please let us all rise. And now unto him who is able to keep us from falling, who is able to present us faultless before his holy presence, this one and only God,
To him be glory, honor, power, and dominion. And now the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit rest and abide with each and every one of you now and forevermore. Amen. The Lord be with you. Thank you. Thank you. My good people, the service is over. Under the service of song over. Tomorrow we will have it. The service at 10 as announced by the clergy. The excellent, your excellencies, we've just welcomed you. The former speaker, right honorable Edward Uchenna Obosi. I salute you too. Chief Anthony Eze of the Channels Construction Company, you are here, ladies and gentlemen, the man who was at the helm of affairs in making the Akari Dami International Airport what it was or what it is, Engineer Chris Okoye, I am supporting you too. You are white in good hands with Justice Ngoboto. God bless all of you. Chinyako has a night of the Methodist Church. Is here with the amiable, beautiful wife. Not just that, ladies and gentlemen. Adali J, you are welcome, sir. It's a pleasure having you in here. Your Excellencies, it's a pleasure. We are glad, we are delighted to meet with you here. We are still uh, hoping that the Almighty Father will see us through by the special grace of God tomorrow and then to the glory of God. We have uh, distinguished Senator Collins uh, Ndo, our chairman. Okay. And then, uh, ladies and gentlemen, we also have uh, uh, distinguished Senator Gil Emeka Naji. Right Honorable Emeka Ujam. We also have a former House of Reps. We also have Igrube. Igrube and Kanulan. Onune Yaka. In a Kenok Wakam. Right Honorable Eugene Odo. Kenel Dr. Emeka Nam. Former Commissioner Lance. Victor, um, God bless you, former chief of protocol, Ezra Bokanaba, the chairman chief executive, Costco Construction Company Limited. Ezra Boka, Chief Cosmo Sagabo, I salute you, I welcome you. Thank you, sir. Ezra Bokanaba, I now say, Honorable Chief Onyemuche Namani. Former SSG, you're welcome, sir. And then the CEO of Autostar Travels Limited, Aina Sigidalo, Anya Enugu, and then uh, Honorable Dickin Ifoma Mwobodo, former Chief of Staff, you're welcome, ma. It's a pleasure having you in here. And Major General, retired CEO Ugu, and then that is Nigerian Ambassador to Poland. You're welcome, sir. Uh, right Honorable. Yes, Igwesi, you are welcome, sir. And then uh, once more, Honorable Edward Obosi, the speaker, Okuroha, Aina Sigedalu, welcome. Almost the tallest here. Wow. Chief John Neji, and then my big brother, Aina Sigedalu, Johnny Neji, you are welcome, sir. God bless you. 
Reverend Nkemwoka Abia, you are welcome, sir. When the evil men conspire, the good ones will combine. But it's not an obodo. We salute you. Igrube ekeneme. Kane kene igrube. Kane kene engineer Mrs. Ujam. By the next two Saturdays, we circulate in your place for your seventh birthday. Venerable. Abo, he came in the company of the Archbishop of the Ecclesiastical Province of Enugu, and uh, the Bishop of Enugu Anglican Diocese, Professor Emmanuel Olisadualum Chukoma. We welcome all of you. We say God bless you. I now see Oyanya Kekenero, Yamana Kenya, Ezo Boka, Ezo Boka. Okay, please, thank you. Dalono, I cannot pass you as you are living. You are worship, Chief Magistrate Ororo. I am saying, no. Onye Onye ka Onye. I am saying you to Central. The Central Working Committee by 8 a.m. talking about tomorrow. I talk on your piano field because I can see a London money, honorable the chief fire officer. 8 a.m. All the set, all the committee members, please be at the field. Our chief fire officer here in the Nugu State. My own dear engineer, or uh her -huh, Daniel, because of you two, everybody should convene, reconvene 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. Ida Lige, Ida Lige, also Ida Lige, because welcome all of us as we are about to wrap it up for the band to take absolutely control. Adali J, you are welcome, sir. It's a pleasure having you in here. And then, Honorable Chief Emeka Ona, Owe na London, Aina Sigidalo, Aina Kene, Honorable Chief Tony Mwonye, the CEO of a Royal Palace Hotel, Aina Sigidalo, Amuroyenego, you are welcome, sir. Eyi, Eyi Gina, Right Honorable USA, Iguesino, Officer Aina Sigidalo, it's Royal Highness Igwe Eben Wobodo. You are welcome, sir. God bless you, sir. And then Chief Sir Emeka Ona Owa Na London. You are welcome, sir. And then Honorable Barrister Steve Arurua. Wow, you are welcome, sir. A legal icon. And then uh, Engineer Emeka Ngene. Aina Sigin No. Honorable Barrister SNC SNC Wagu. You are welcome, sir. God bless you, sir. Engineer, the sound engineer, I must say, you are wonderfully wonderful. Our sound engineer, God bless you. What Diana? What Diana? Enuku Reverend Mokabia, I salute you, sir. Because the committee members at the central level, if tomorrow morning at 8 a.m., let us all assemble at Ophuto, where it is what it is happening. Because Oyabuna Bakoba, 8 o'clock, Mr. Mecca Uguoju. I salute your presence. Prof. Prof. Prof, God bless you. Prof. Prof, get through the Okemwa. I salute you. Because, Onyanya Bobegafa, 
Kaje Hetroge. We have never seen you. That is why we've never recognized you. Sinato Ben Colin Sindo walking assiduously with the Speaker Emeritus of Enugu State as chairman and co chairman. Let me welcome this very new area commander in Enugu State, uh, Assistant Commissioner West. You are welcome to, to East. You are uh, SCP West. I welcome you to East. God bless you. Thank you very much. Please, my master, Chief Lawrence Alobi, former commissioner here, in, commissioner of police here in Enugu State, and former commissioner of police also in Lagos State. You are welcome, sir. Alobi Mayoga, you are welcome, sir. We actually appreciate your presence here. Engineer Mrs. Lola Uche Ojam, I know singing now. And then Chief John Neji, God bless you, sir. And then uh, once more, my organ, right honorable Edward Obosi, Otege. You're welcome, sir. And then uh, with every humility, ladies and gentlemen, we have uh, honorable, we have uh, right Reverend Dr. Ike Nelson Aniabo. I know singing now, young Kanabo. I know singing now. Can chairman in Nugu South and then former chairman of the General Assembly. You are welcome, sir. God bless you. And then, uh, Honorable Chief Mwabeza Namani. Ikoha. Ikoha, I know singing now. And then former chairman in Kanu West uh, local government area. Custom officer, retired but not yet tired. You are welcome, sir. God bless you, sir. God bless you. And then uh, we have uh, Lolo Chijiabo. Ladies and gentlemen, I am sending in a non central committee. non committee. Have put on our by eight o'clock in the morning tomorrow. That's a special announcement. Thank you. Honorable Sam Okechuku Ngane. I welcome you. Member that represented us at the House of Assembly. Honorable Sam Ngane. Thy fellow Maka, no fellow Maka. Bakaragino Kwa Kamsu. Eh? Do Kuwafo, I am seeing you with Honorable Sam Ngade. Chief Sack, Chris Okoye, engineer, I salute you once more. Ladies and gentlemen, we will boost this music to keep us going and uh, rolling as we are leaving this arena, for it is all over, but we will have to recognize few more persons for the music to be heightened so that it will be what we should do. Right on the board watch, the chairman of the planning committee, yes, sir. Yes, sir. he worked well yes, sir. Yes, sir. with distinguished senator Ben Collins Sindhu, Anya Enugu, the man representing South East and the Police Service Commission, former Secretary to Enugu State Government, yes, Onyebuche Namani. Yes, yes, right Honorable Anna Yuede, Barista Jerry, and uh, Dr. Moye, Dr. Barista Moye. Deaconess Doctor Ifama Wobodo Safranka Nyoma Agamofwanya Rapu Madonna His Excellency Godiabo Ogomo Jiwa 
His Excellency Ambassador Godi Abo na Tumato Josia, Ibona Magi, Aina Sigin, no, I Sigin Dalogina, Tumato Josia, Aina Sodui, Lolo Chijabo, no, Aina Kenekuziawa, Igrubeze, the CEO of McDonald's PLC, Aina Sigin Dalo, what are you the no man came na Nigeria? Honorable Sam Okechukungene, Nyana, Honorable Barrister Duke Mwafo. Once a deputy mayor is always a deputy mayor. You are welcome, sir. And then Chief Oliver Abo, Chief Apostle Oliver Abo, the CEO of One Day International Hotel, sir. PLC, you are welcome, sir. Former Commissioner for Finance and a member Civil Service Commission Board, my own dear sister from another mother, Dr. Eukarya Ofo, the wife to four General Commissioner, Sir Chris Ofo. I salute the two of you. Honestly, you are welcome, ma. And then Chief Julian Oswala, Oswala, you're welcome. Engineer Barrister Ava. Engineer Barrister Ava, you're welcome, sir. I now say, oh, Amuma. Amuma, you're welcome. And then, uh, Okechuku Barrister, Okechuku Ede, a legal icon. I now say, Dalo, I now can Chief John, if I didn't have money. And that is Ezed Yorama. Ezed Yorama, you're welcome, sir. Chief Francis Honor, a U.S. based businessman, you are welcome, sir. As your guy, and then Chief Sir Emeka Honor, on one in London, I know, Segedalo, ladies and gentlemen, we are glad to have you here. Honestly, thank you for honoring this very family the good lord we meet all of you at our own points of need also kunida lije chinya koha or mellow man or mellow ma i once more say god bless you our dpo you are indebatable god bless you you are doing well Supervising and making sure that all is well. Onu na yaka. Igurube na mwe. CEO. McDonald Intercontinental Ballistic Infantry. I welcome you. Ofonye lulafia on hana zop. One man who laugh here, Ohana Zo. Let me recognize a member of the MMI, member of the Microphone Institute. Why are I cheer the number? Why are I oppose one now? Yes, see your rebel yes, see your kid yes, outright. Sam, okay, Chukungene, right, right, honourable, you are. God bless you, ladies and gentlemen. Let us enjoy this music as we are living gradually, because I cannot nazi, because it is all over. Don't ever think there were anything like wake up. Nobody is waking. Nobody is keeping. It is all over. Let us be living gradually by gradually. Please, let us be living gradually by gradually. If we have not recognized you, hold your PA or SA responsible. Because we must not see everybody. Uh, please, uh, we appreciate the presence of... Uh... Right Honorable Nelson Maduka Arum, Mama PLC, Mama Aina Segedalo, 
mama aina kenegi makiye ni ne moko mayendo zoni ni mecheleba aina sigedalo mama malaika the bishop i say no god bless you and then uh, on behalf of my colleagues honestly on behalf of my colleagues i appreciate each and every one of us here to the glory of god god bless Burus. Burus. Ogaberi Ototo. My master. Right honorable. If I the Lawrence Ugwai C O N. God bless you. Seated with another of my master. A product of University of Jaws. Where I am an alumnus. Oh, well, it's all my day. All my day. Good day, no, was it? Bocala, no, me, in my day. All my day. We are the day. Go, Baba, sing this. We are the time. I will let the link. If you know, we know, we His Excellency, Chief Doctor, Senator, you can na mane. Eba ina bia krenjo makau ya wohor. I na see you can na mane. Yeka nyadalo. Please, at this particular point in time, I na see all one Africa. What an man who gonna man on a denta? I should have car. Ha, Osoko, Igu, Intara, Akakoche, Anukuna Choya. I not say that I'll walk on my walk on my. I say, Good car. Good car, so be. God bless you, sir. A bico. I talk. Only God to cool out your belly. Can we tell you for a good package? You and I want only. My can I never babble? Ugly go, ugly go. Chief Ken, if a boy, man, 
Oh, when I book as a Roger River, I in a city, God bless you. Oh, welcome, CP Lawrence and Lope. Oh, bros of police commission, like a law. Each of whom are Nigerian Football Federation. Go see for case you control traffic. And uh, His Excellency, Senator Dr. Jimmy Faichuku Wobodo, Obiareba alone. Obia with Her Excellency, the admirable, beautiful, Pachi Jim Wobodo. Jimmy Foloso. Makoburi no e cholunja nya ma na etuki ji o because the indulo e ma ma ka ji etuki ji o course is in nawi o course is in nawi o mel be the pure devil bena number state o je nawi je maluna na fuzo metulu mo ma le fi wola so ma le fi wola no ma de ko bo na chine ka bro tata Oh yes, he formed the name. We formed the name. No, I am a quack of Kuta. Naiba la Pamazo. Oh, you know, you are sixty years. Ebos, you would them. If I know Lina Kagako, the mother of Ruba Opuru or Karocha or Yaranya or Sisi Eko, but Sisi Amech. I fabo. But I can see that I can and I'm not get the beer now. But senior, I know when you tell me, I know when you when you can bring girls or what come on what at a night. But I can then do now. Look at that. Then do see that all Gil and Makana J as a mugger can I know more right on the right now and Sia no dogu akataka. O gondi demri. O gondi demri. Email ye ke. Makadibu o gondi demri. I demri o pododike. O kwa muno me. O kogo. Obya. 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 Wadita ne guwa. Wadita guwa. Wadita guwa. Wadita guwa. Wadita guwa. Manechi eni ozu anumana indita. Oya mbi ko baba zintezi o oya kuta avula dalenge nifuna we na weba nifuna we na weba oya mbi. Baba sinkese Kuya kuta Avola talingi Nifuna wena weta Nifuna wena weta Kuya kuta Kubaba sinkese Kuya kuta Avola talingi Nifuna wena weta Nifuna wena weta